to continue with Tibetan painting styles from the late late uh, 17th, early 18th century, uh, aside from the Pulpung style, we have also the Kampagar. Kampagar is a Drukpa Kagyu establishment in um, East Tibet, uh, located in the region of Latok. And they developed a painting style that is that they claim is based on Kenri, Menri, and Kamri. Now, what this means is it means that they're borrowing from the earlier 16th century, 15th century Kenri style and tradition, the Menri from Mentangpa style and tradition, but then they're including something called Kamri. It's, it's, it's a calm style, uh, uh, an aesthetic of, of calm that these artists seem to be aware of. And these three different styles are merged together. And, and it's, it, it's really uh, hard to explain because we're talking about traditions now. We're borrowing from traditions. We're not borrowing from a specific uh, style that can be nailed down to a specific artist and, and at a specific time and with uh, very clear examples of what they always mean by the stylistic elements of the drawing, uh, the color palette, and the overall composition. So with the Kampagar style we do have very bold colors but then we do have a lot of landscape that is that is uh, uh, put in the background more landscape than you would find in pulpung paintings in the pulpung style uh, so, so overall we could say the paintings are, are the composition is more full they're, they're a little busier there's a lot more elements uh, the colors are very bright uh, there's a lot of blue green stone which is often an element of, of the background landscape within the Kinri and the, and the Menri, that, then it's uh, used for human figures. Um, in, the, in the Lato Kakampagar paintings, the, then they use a lot of, uh, of natural and natural stylized landscape that would be reserved for humans that they've added with uh, uh, peaceful and wrathful deity paintings. Some of the best examples of the of the uh, Kampagar style are, are sets of Mahasiddhas, the 84 great Mahasiddhas. And we have a number of examples of very good, very uh, uh, well-preserved, uh, with very little, little damage or, or extensive wear. So we have a lot of examples to look at. Um, and it's very clear when you look at these paintings compared with Pulpung, compared with Menri, New Menri or Kinri, that, that they are using a lot of ele elements, but they are very different. They are their own style. So that's the Kampagar style of the Drukpa Kagyu from Latok in East Tibet.